tacos, a traditional Mexican food that you can find right here in Trinidad and Tobago. You know, it consists of a folded tortilla topped with a filling of meat, lettuce, salsa, and a few other things. Ooh, what's up my Trinbago vibe peeps? Welcome to another episode of Trinbago Vibes. In this one, we are eating tacos. So let's go. So right now we on Cipero Street in San Fernando and we hitting the first taco joint, which is Chimichangas. And joining me is our awesome subscriber, Mark. Yeah, so let's head inside and order some tacos. Yeah. Uh, good, good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning, morning, morning. How are you going? Good, good. How are you doing? I good. Let's turn something up. What time do you all open? open at 11. 11? Yeah. Every day? No, from Tuesday to Friday. Tuesday to Fridays? Yeah. And then I see Oli also have a, a cart down on the cross. Yeah. So they have to do? I do the Friday and Saturday. Friday and Saturday? Yeah, from 6. six. six oh, yeah. 6. Alright, alright. So. So nice and we've we come to order the tacos. What type of tacos you all have? Beef chicken and vegetarian. Beef chicken and vegetarian. Mark, which one are you having? Beef. Which one have? Beef? Yeah. Alright, well, we want to get one, one beef, one chicken. Oh, you see, I have big guns here today. Yeah, big guns. <laughs> so it's cool. Tech Technology is limited, yeah. Yeah, so they do IT and they also do videography. videography. Well. Yeah. So I'll leave a link to their stuff in the description below. So now for the tacos. Where we went, one hard shell and one soft shell, you know, and we took everything we could have taken as toppings in this taco. So, I mean, two tacos for 35 TTD in bad at all at Chimichanga's Mexican Grill, right here in South Trinidad, San Fernando. Well, the two sources we have is sour cream and chipotle. You're taking both cream. Yeah, we going all out in this one. Look at this peeps. Those are pickled onions as a garnish on top of the tacos and some cheese, they packed. And I can't really tell which one is the chicken and which one is the beef, like if you put them side by side. Yeah. Are we taking into it? Mm -hmm. Which one are you going with this? I'm going to be hard. This is. I have to come up and show them a little. Yeah. Look how much. This chicken. Real flavorful. Just tell me, how, how was the beef? Very good. This, the seasoning is just right. Cheesy. The um, pickled onions was on fire. Yeah. The sauces, the condiments, very good. Nice. 100% recommend. <laughs> you hear that? Nice, nice, nice. And the same could be said with the chicken as well. It's seasoned. It kind of reminds me of a curry chicken, kind of. A little bit. The chicken itself, the tacos itself. Which is good because you, you know me, I like my um, curry. And the shell is nice and everything. And as Mark said, that pickle onion win. And the condiments just goes with it, it complements it. And yeah, you get what I expect a taco to be, you know? The little corn, the tomato slash salsa, some cheese. So yeah, this is at Chimichangas, right here on Tipera Street, San Fernando. Alright, you heard the times they open, you see what they have, you got an idea of the menu. Alright, on to the next. So big up Mark for joining me in South at Chimichangas. I'm joined here by my wife, Julia. Yeah. Yeah. I know she hasn't tasted the chimichangas one, that was my bad, that was my bad. <laughs> but we in town right now and we go in 51 ingredients. So yeah, so right here on, this is Elizabeth Street, right opposite the Trini Pussy stand. Trini Pussy stand <laughs> at our over, next to Full Bloom Coffee. So this is Full Bloom Coffee, and we're going right there, 51 ingredients. So this is town side, you know, Port of Spain side. And these are their prices. Now let's time lapse these tacos. Cue music. Hard shell and I went soft shell, you know. And um, well, Boo decided to get some nachos, and both of them cost like you get the tacos, burritos, the full works here as well. But like they have fixed cost for whatever meat you want. And we went chicken in both cases, so it was 60 TT. Yeah, so this year you get you know the hard shell, the soft shell tacos. I'm gonna say tortilla, yeah, and, and you also got some tortilla chips as well. 
Yeah, so that's cool. Oh, that is yeah, so I'm going to go hard shell first because you know I like the hard shell. Mm -hmm. Oh, so but I won't like this looking real, real, real good. And I have here this is this whole it's smelling good too. Oh, hear that crunch. Ah, chimichangas. The meat was more grind up more and tasting similar to like I would say kind of it reminds me of curry a little bit, but this one is more grilled. The freshness of the tomatoes and the onions. And then the cheese complements the chicken and the taco itself. Mm. Tastes real, real good. Wow. But this is cool. Well, Julia tried that. So that, because you know, sometimes the ingredients will fall off the taco itself. <laughs> so we actually have tortilla chips to pick up whatever. That is clever. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yum. This tastes real good. Eh? That is tasty. Mm -hmm. Wow. It's like a perfect blender taste. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'd say. Let me just try the soft shell. Mm -hmm. So that was it hard. You had soft shell um, in some? Yep. No. This. Hit this spot too. Mm. Wow. Which one better? I can't tell the difference because I like the crunchiness. Yeah. Are they hard? Mm -hmm. But the soft one, it goes together with everything else oh. as well. Real, real good. And like holding everything together, can't mm -hmm. mm. And you know me, I like my roti so <laughs> come on <laughs> and you saw the the nachos that julia got it looks amazing like a full meal it does look like yeah. a full meal i really didn't expect the nachos to be like that and i was expecting nachos to be like you know again movie tongue just chips and some melted cheese but look at that wow yeah. that oh my too, God. it looks so great all right our third taco stop is on arapita avenue by Sakura Arts. Well, the corner of Taylor Street and the avenue, you know, you just go around to the side of the building and you'll find Taco Mel. And the tacos here cost around 55 TTD for like two tacos. And it was basically just like one type of taco shell here that they were using. And I mean, it gets semi-crunchy after it's been on the grill. By the way, we covered Sakura Arts already as well as Full Bloom Coffee which we saw earlier in the video and I will leave a link to those in the description below just in case you haven't seen them. Alright, let's try these tacos out. Previously, we put the meat in the taco itself and then they put everything else on top of it. And this one, they put the lettuce first, then the meat, and then everything on top oh. of it. So, this is interesting. In this taco episode, I would like to say hop in, but not really because we tried some different days. This, this one all smelling good. I don't know if it's the fresh ingredients oh, or I'm what. The sour cream. Yeah, it could be the, the, the sour cream. Taco number three. So far, the two tacos, what I had, was on point. The one in South, nice. good. And the one, 51 mm -hmm. ingredients was real good. Yeah. Hmm. This one I feel, because of how much meat, the shredded meat I got, I feel like I'm eating like I almost am meat pie. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Let, let me try like the jalapenos come through. But it's not as flavorful as the other two we had just now. Mm. It's chewy now because the how compact the meat is. No, I see what you're saying. What do you think? Mm. Okay, so what I could say is because the meat is shredded and I don't think it has as much seasoning in it, mm -hmm. you're getting a more kind of watery taste. I give okay, well, yeah, you know, the meat clean, it, it, it shred and you know, they cook it, but it's like it had no big set of seasoning or anything in it. The others were more like dice, mm -hmm. like cube up the meat and things, so it'll still get a flavor. So this. Yeah. Because like the first part chimichangas, it was like I'm listening. You know, the meat mm -hmm. was shredded, but it was a flavor in the mouth. Like right? if they cook the meat cook in, in some it's more in, yeah. flavor. Yeah, this one need stuff. need the mm -hmm. meat. The chicken at least needs a little more seasoning and truth. Yeah, is is the chicken? Is the chicken? Is chicken. chicken? Because I mean mm -hmm. the fresh ingredients. Yeah. Chicken is this this part Real of fresh. the the taco itself, the, the shell itself. It, it Kinda soft and crunchy. Yeah. Kinda. <laughs> On to the next one. All right. So this is the Endeavour Connector Road. That is made for the gas station here, and you see this cool breeze. There's enough pizza there. 
and the taco shop is right here taco and wings so as soon as you either come up from there or come down from here you're swinging in this little compound here and the taco place is right there and these are their prices i saw they had wings so we'll go back and try their wings one of these days shout out to the ladies there for this one i got three tacos for 60 tt now they have like numerous ingredients and you could only choose four well they had like four sauces so i went with like a barbecue sauce and a spicy meal and the chicken here is like grilled chicken so kind of feel like if i eat a chicken burger like those chicken burger cuts that's how the the meat tastes like the spicy mayo kind of overpowering the other flavors in the taco itself the shell is nice is it is crunchy and um but the pine adds, adds a little sweetness to it let me just try the soft shell and yeah but i won't lie it packed with a lot of stuff even like the few things i got It's this one. It's this one. It's not bad. Alright. This is the fourth one. We have one more to do. Oh yes. It's cash only. Cash only. Like don't, don't make the mistake. I went there with exactly $59. And so I shot $1. And I was real searching for $1. And they said like, nah, don't worry. They'll put it in for me. I was like, alright. Thank you so much. So big up them. There at Tacos and Wings. Right off the, the Endeavor Connector Road right there in Shugonas. So we've had one in South, Big Up Mark and Chimichangas. We have one in Central, Taco and Wings and we having three up for the spin side. 51 ingredients, Taco Melt and finally our fifth one, Rock Work Deli right here on the avenue. Well, not so much on the avenue. The entrance is actually on Devotile Street South. So this here is the tacos for 36 TT. Yeah, look at that. They have doubled and triple, right? The triple is 49 TT. And basically, you get your meat and you get to choose two sides. I went with pine and lettuce. And then you have like a, a set of sauces. And I really like their sweet Thai sauce, peanut sauce. Yeah. So, let's see. I'm going to just do toppings in this one but the meat in this is seasoned well the and the sauce is is really the winning factor in this and yeah this is the fifth taco spot in this one five taco spots right here in Trinidad and Tobago like okay if I had to round them it have been, I'll give Taco Mel the fifth place, Tacos and Wings the fourth place, I'll give Rap Book Deli the third place, second drum roll would be Chimichangas in South, and first place would have been 51 ingredients. Yeah, 51 is the more expensive one. But the most of stuff you get and the flavor profile was very, very good. And plus the nachos in that one was a, a good idea. Chimichanga is the next value for money for 35 TT. It's like you can't go wrong there at all. And the flavors there is like wow. Like to be honest, taco mel and tacos and wings is almost on the same level. In terms of the meat could have probably been a little more seasoned. Yeah. And well, that works deli, the chicken here is seasoned well. And the sauces like complements everything else. So yeah, hope you enjoyed that one. Five taco spots, taco hopping, train bagel vibes. Just hit that like button, you know, it helps with the algorithm. And let me know what you all think. Let me know if you all know of our taco spots here in Trinidad to Bigo one. Hopefully we'll tackle it one of these days. Until then, I'll see you all in the next one. Ha gone. Later. Go and do another taco spot? Not right now. <laughs> no, well, well, what taco spot is that? Hmm? I'm trying to do five not to go with oh. Cinco de Mayo.